Come here. Come on. Come on. Hey everyone, what's up? It's Brooke Tommy here, and today you're going to be watching a vlog, but more so based around having two dogs and how that sort of works and what it looks like because I've grown up with dogs my whole life. At one stage I had five. I know that's illegal. Don't dob on me. But at the moment I only have two and that for some people might be a question on your lips about what it's actually like to have two dogs, especially one that's like a small one and a big one. How do they get along? What do they play like? Do they hate each other? Do they love each other? Anyway, so this is Seed of the Border Collie, Sprinkle the Italian Greyhound, Brooke Tomo, the vlogger. I haven't been on in a while now. There's a reason for that and it's because I was depressed for two days. If you want to know more about that, uh, listen to my podcast. I dealt right into that because last vlog I did, I said that I was hoping I had celiac disease. All the stomach pain was actually in my head and it was a subconscious program, I believe. That has been lingering in the background for a couple of years and that just manifested as physical pain slash nausea slash. I still do think I have intolerances to some stuff, but really grateful it happened to me and I could get past it and every day's a journey. It's just life doesn't make sense. Like life is just to me so bizarre. I think I'm really more so on a spiritual journey than anything because I've been doing so much meditating. Girls! What are you two doing in here? Causing a literal ruckus. Cedar, give your sister a cut. Your name's Sprinkle. Give Cedar a cuddle. Give her a cuddle. That's nice, girls. She's pinned you down, Cedar. She's pinning you down. Sprinkle's second birthday is next month. Cedar turned two in May. So they're both around two. Stop pinning your sis down. Spring. Spring. <laughs> oh, you're making this bed so dirty. Hop off. Look at this. Oh, yuck. Yuck. Go, go, go. Go, girls. Go, girls. Go, girls. Go get your frisbee. Yeah, you heard that right, didn't you? It's the two-tone colours for me. So yeah, if you are new to this channel, this is a reno house. You can go back and look at my other vlog where we bought the house and that has all the original colours. <laughs> Interesting choices. So I think I'm also on a spiritual journey, but I'm not going to talk about that on here because if you want to hear all about that, that's on my podcast. Uh, all talking belief systems and the mind and what it means. But I've been having some really cool meditations lately and I just, the difference of a person that I am is just epic and I'm thriving. So I've been called to make a vlog. So spend the week with me, see what it's like having two dogs. Personally, I love it. I love dogs. I'm a dog person. You won't catch me with a cat. And if you're wondering if you should get two dogs or not, depends on the space that you're in. However, I'm a big advocate for it. So I think by the end of this video, you'll want two dogs. If you have any questions, any breeds or anything, like just post. I'm not owned every single breed out there, but I do know a fair bit about a fair few breeds. So if you're wondering like, I have a German Shepherd, should I get a Chihuahua, blah, blah, blah. Just ask and I'll see if I can help you. But yeah, stay tuned. Frisbee, can you give it a touch quickly? Say, see you later. What you got? Can you get your frisbee and bring it here, please? Oh, spring, always in the frame, Bob. Bring it here, Terriel. Oh, really? Yeah. Get your frisbee. Would you like to go and play some frisbee toy toy? Come and heal. How bad do you want to play, Teriel? Focus. Kiss. That's lovely. Okay, go, 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 go. Whoa, that is fast. So the current clock time is 11.08. Now, I don't start teaching until 3.30, which means I'll leave here at 3. The only things I really want to get done today is I want to clean the house, just tidy. It's not too messy at the moment, but I just want to tidy it because clean house, clean mind. And then I didn't get to take seed for a walk this morning, so I better play frisbee with her. Also want to schedule in some time to meditate, and then I also want to work for the electrical company and cut some more music for my dance studios because Christmas time is approaching and also I need to get back on this YouTube train because if you know me you bloody well should know that Christmas is my literal vibe and I was just 
guilty watching myself on YouTube and looked at my 2021 Christmas decoration. I've got a whole new house. I've got new spaces to fill. I've got new gaps to find things for. We need to together collectively go shopping and find the best 2022 bargains that there is for Christmas. I went to Target yesterday. They've bought out the Christmas stuff already. It's September. So we've got time, yeah? Yeah? I want 5,000 subscribers by Christmas, okay? So rally around, subscribe, so we can spend Christmas together because Christmas is the best time of the year. Anyway, being a Border Collie loves, loves to play Frisbee. Now, I have also trained her to do this. Cedar, go for a run. She does just a lappy. She does a lappy around the house. She'll pop back up here. Boom. That's how you tire out a Border Collie. Stop eating. Stop eating earbuds. Sprinkle. You're disgusting. Come, Sprink. <gasps> sprinkle has a turn. Go, Sprinkle. Oh, and then she just doesn't bring it back. Okay, see. <laughs> no, they seriously love each other. Look at them. Oh, that was fast. The best thing about having two dogs is that they play with each other and keep each other entertained most of the time. Go for a run. She just waits for Cedar. And then she just chases her really fast. Sprinky, give Cedar a cuddle. Good girl. Interesting spatial awareness. Now this is one thing you're gonna have to deal with if you're looking at getting two dogs. Is the sharing of the toys. Now I could have two of these toys, but they would never be chewing them at the same time. If Sprinkle has it, Cedar wants it. If Cedar has it, Sprinkle wants it. But they're really good at sharing. Cedar's the boss, so Cedar will always growl at Sprinkle, which I allow because Sprinkle would steal everything of Cedar's if Cedar wasn't the boss. Uh, but then I can also tell Cedar to give Sprinkle a turn and Cedar will just stop what she's doing and let Sprinkle have whatever she has. So that's something that I recommend training in your dogs if you do decide to get two. And also if you're going to get a white couch, get a dog blanket. <laughs> now I am about to vacuum because... There's clumps of material hair everywhere. Seriously. Have you ever seen anything more cute? Oh, did you hear me? And you see Sprinkle's head just here. Oh. You're snuggling on your section, aren't you girls? Sprinkle! Oh, hi, baby dogs. You want to go to your pen? Do you want to go to your pen while your mummy goes to work? You know, one thing I will say that I absolutely love about having two dogs is that I can leave and not worry. If you feel like you're worried about your dog, if they're a solo dog and they're by themselves, uh, just get your dog a dog. <laughs> like I, I'm telling you, I'm an advocate for two dogs. So if you, if you don't think you want two dogs, then probably stop watching because all I'm going to talk about is how good it is. I'm about to go lock them up in their pen and they just wait there. I'm only gone for an hour and a half today, but you know, just thought I'd touch on that. If you're thinking, will two dogs ease my stress and anxiety about leaving my dog at home by themselves? The answer is yes because it does for me. Who's doing work at the moment and about to go do different work. Got six minutes left of doing this electrical stuff then I'm gonna go get changed. Then I'm gonna drive, go drive to teaching. I'm gonna teach, I'm gonna come home. I've got the rest of the day off. I finish at five o'clock. Okay, let's go to your pen and have some pen treaties. Come on, girls. The girls were lucky enough to be sent a package from this company, Layla and me, just with their new freeze dried range and uh, they honestly have been a godsend. Like I've fed the dogs so many treats before, but none of them, well one, they love as much as this one. And two, because it's only like in this one, it's chicken breast. Ingredients, chicken breast. Like that's the only, only ingredient in there. It's actually the only treat that doesn't make them do stinky dog pops. Not only do they love the taste of them, but it makes their bellies feel good. Yummy, yummy. They're like little meringues, but chicken pieces. They just stay in there together. They've just recently ripped up a new toy, so I do have to clean that, but it's 
not a today thing, you know what I mean? It's just not a today thing. Now, I don't think this is in any pet shops. They found me on Instagram, so follow them there. I seriously highly recommend their stuff. Not paid, not sponsored, just gifted. Love. Good morning. I just did my morning meditation and bitgloomy.com today. I should message Sid because I'm supposed to be going to his house for the filming of the podcast, but if it's going to be affected by the rain, then we wouldn't do it. But this is what happens. It's 7 a.m. and you're pushing all the boundaries that you have, so stop it. See, it's getting cranky at you. See, but see, there's like that, but I can come in and move her away. You know, do whatever I want. She would never growl at me. I can take her food away. I can tell her to stop. Okay. But she's just getting mad at Sprinkle. <laughs> okay. Love you, pumpkin. Did you miss your mama? If you need to go outside, ring your bell. Oh, good material! Just got home from filming the podcast. Now, I don't work until 3 p.m. And it is currently 10.44. I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, wow. Two girls that are sisters and friendly friends. Come here, Seedy. I'm going to get you seed. I'm going to get you seed. Speak. Oh, speak. 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 Oh, go spring. How about spring? Ready, sprinkle has a turn. Sit. Go sprinkle. She really wants to play the frisbee. But it's raining and you will get dirty. What is it? Give it a kitty. Then give your mum a kiss. Quickly. That's friendly. Whee! Yuck, that's so festy dirty. But am I changing it? No, and literally you can't stop me. See, this is the thing. When it's raining, I'm like, where do I leave the docks? Or I leave them outside and they get dirty, but they have more room to play. Or do I leave them in the laundry? I think I'll leave them outside. I left them in the laundry just then, but my mind is so much less stressed about them when they're outside, just because if they need to go to the toilet, it's right there. If they want to dig holes or get destructive, they can do that. Like they have so many more options to boredom bust than in the laundry. You want to do some spring? Come here, spring. Sit. Arr. Sweet. Bucking ball. Whoa, sit. Spring hole. Be human. What? Be human, spring. Woohoo! Go Sprinkle! Maybe would you like to play some indoor bubbles? Because it's raining and we can't play freeze because you will get too dirty. Would you instead, you need to focus, would you instead like to play with your bubbles? Oh, Cedar! Go give your bubbles a kiss. <laughs> the little pity pats on the floor are so cute. Can you spin? Turn. Come here, sit, drop, roll over. You want this one really bad, then you need to give it a kiss. You need to speak. <laughs> <gasps> Down. Oh. So cute. Sit, please, and see you later. That was nice. What a lovely day. Literally, what a lovely day. I just spent, I think, like two hours just like being, just not resisting the now. You know, I've done so much spiritual learning over the last two weeks. I'm just like, I think I'm thriving. Like, I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. Yeah, I can't wait to see what plays out in my life over the next couple of months, weeks, months, years. These are top. Look how rainy it was this morning, and now all of a sudden, it's just so sunny. Okay, that is all. Love you lots.
Bye. Good morning. It is 7.30 now in the morning. I just woke up and the dogs are begging me for breakfast because everyone's hungry. Are you hungry? Say hello to the vloggings. Oh, and what about you, Sprink? Sit. Sprink, are you hungry? Really? Hello? Oh, I think that is a yes. Okay, let's have some breakfast. Or maybe should we go outside and go do a pee? Go ring your bell. Good girl material. Heel. Oh, she's clever. See, they go do a pee. What a glorious day. So the plan is I'm just going to run to Coles because I just really feel like raspberries this morning on my special key. And then Amanda's coming over and we're going to take the dogs for a walk. And then I teach at 1 p.m. I'm not supposed to teach on Saturdays, but I just said yes. Because I didn't work on Monday because I was sick. So yeah, the girls are going to love going for a walk this morning. It's such a beautiful day. And I'll give them breakfast before we go. Um, hopefully that will tire them out. Who am I kidding? It never does. It never tires Cedar out. Even a 45 minute walk? No. She's still go, go, go. She wants to go home and play frisbee. That's the plan for today. So I'm going to peace you out and catch up with you later. So I just got home from Coles and I just saw that this gig that I did back in 2021 just got released. It was just like a, it's called the Crunk app. It's a place where you can message people and meet up to do like the same activity. And ours was dancing. Good times, good times. But yeah, Amanda's coming over soon. We go take the dogs for a walk and then I go teaching. Okay, bye. Someone's taking advantage. Spring. <laughs> My friend Carla. Hello. And her best friend, Sprinkle. <laughs> <laughs> well, you go see your Auntie Carla. Hello. No, now this is her real bestie. Cedar loves Auntie Carla. Give her a cuddle. Oh, you're so nice, material. Sprinkle. You're so cute, but also so naughty. Get your little butt off the pillow. Oh my gosh, hi, long time to see. Uh, so it's Sunday now. It's about 1 p.m. I just dropped Carla home and yeah, it's a lazy Sunday afternoon from now on. So when Carla was here, we went to the shops quickly and we bought, well, I bought some new books, uh, some new spirituality books. So I'm just going to spend the afternoon reading my new books and relaxing. That's all I have. I'll cut some music for tomorrow, but I could do that tomorrow. You know what I mean? That could be a tomorrow job. But let me check in with the girls. Sprink is having an absolute bake. Aren't you sprinky? You're having just a tiny little bake. So cute. <laughs> and CD is waiting to play with some frisbee, which is up there on top of the fridge. So we played some frisbee with her earlier today, but she just is a Fruit Loop and doesn't have an off button and gets too hot. Like too hot as in she will faint. Like there's been a couple times when We've been at the park and she just doesn't stop and we don't know when she's getting too puffed and she uh, like gets real woozy on the way back like starts to lose her balance it's really really scary so i can only play frisbee with her for about 10 minutes at a time because she gets so hot and today's probably the hottest day it's been since like may to be honest so i think it's 27 degrees so it's amazing it's really really beautiful weather like seriously check that out can you deal and Carla and I, when we were here, we were just talking about possibly going to Port Douglas in the first week of December. So if that happens, I'll take you guys along with me. Uh, we've also got coming up our Christmas decorating vlog, which we will do yearly. My mum comes down and we absolutely go ballistic because we both love decorating. And yeah, any other videos you want to see, please let me know. I want to help people out. I know I get a lot of questions about dogs. I'm no pro or anything, but I mean, I've got a really well-trained dog that I did all myself. Um, that one, not so much, but I purposely didn't train her. Like, that's the difference. This is, Sprinkle is so naughty because I purposely did not train her, whereas I spent so much time training her. 
and they're polar opposites. <laughs> so, love you both though, doll. Come here, Sprink. Like, that's what I'm talking about. Sprinkle, come. Good girl. Love you, Bubby. Are you having a luffily time doing the baking in the sun, Bob? So cute. Go for a run. I'm gonna leave the vlog here. That's sort of what two dogs looks like in my life. Again, if you're considering it, highly recommend. Make sure you have the space, make sure you have the time to train. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. So see you everyone. <laughs>